Hey guys, this is Fizzy Games here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to fix the location is unavailable error on Windows 7, 8, and 10. So let's get straight into it, guys. Now, if you haven't received this error before, it usually appears when you're copying files from a USB to the computer or the other way around, um, or if you're moving files between directories on your PC. So I have a few fixes here today. Can't guarantee they're all going to work. Some of them don't even work for me, but I'll show you some of them. So the first step is to go into CMD. Now this one does not work for me, but if it does for you, then that's good. You want to run it as admin, and then you want to type in the following code. Now links will be in description for this. And you want to replace the letter E with the drive in which your file is in. So in my case, my file is right here. It's a movie, so it's on the local disk C. So I'm going to type in C and hit enter. Now for me, it doesn't work. But if done correctly, if it does work for you, it will start scanning the drive for any malicious content, any errors, and then Windows Diagnostics will fix it after that. Uh, that's just one solution. Now the next solution is moving the file out of your downloads. So if you have the file in your downloads section, you want to move it out of there onto your desktop because it makes it harder for uh, the system to find where the file is and it often tricks it and then it will say that message. So move it out of your downloads just onto the desktop and then you can place it wherever you want after that. Now the next step is renaming the file. So simply renaming the file could be the fix for you. I know it is for me. Always helps. I just put capitals in it. Pretty simple. Then you can put it wherever you want and it will work. All right. The last step is restarting your computer. Now you probably think this is stupid but it actually works. Restarting your computer is actually like the easiest solution to any problem on Windows. Just a simple restart or two will fix the problem instantly. That's it guys. If you have any comments, um, put them down below. Any questions, I can try to help you. That's about it. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button as always. Peace out guys.